I just wanted to make a few comments about Ronda Rousey versus Holly Holm. I think it is absolutely ridiculous that um, this rematch is being called. Ronda Rousey didn't get beat by a lucky punch. Ronda Rousey got beat by a person that was a former world champion boxer and learnt their trade in MMA. Ronda Rousey believed her own hype. Ronda Rousey believed she was unbeatable and then came against a boxer and tried to box a boxer with no boxing ability whatsoever. Was walking onto big shots with a chin up in the air with absolutely zero boxing ability. And it was like a club fighter versus, well, just a club fighter versus a world-class fighter. It's not that Holly Holm was a, um, you know, also ran or has been. Holly Holm was a world champion and a very good world champion. The fight that she never had, it was against, um, what's the girl's name again? Uh, the lady, the, the first lady, uh, I forgot her name. Uh, Cecilia Breakers, that's the one. Cecilia Breakers, how oh, forgive me, Cecilia? How can I forget you? Now, Cecilia Breakers, yeah, Holly Holm never fought Cecilia Breakers, and you can kind of see why. Um, all this talk about she would have beaten Layla Ali, and I said before, stop the stupid talk that Ronda Rousey would have beaten Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather, oh, well, I'd, let's not talk about it. So, the question number one is. She's got no boxing skills. So what is she going to do different in a rematch? What, get fitter? Well, no. You're still going to walk onto counters. So you need to develop your boxing skills. You need to learn how to slip a punch and counter. You know, boxing. You know, so so your, um, your ground game is working on, if that's the term. And I don't see how you can develop your ground game between now and July. I'm sorry. Not going to happen. And by the way, while Ronda Rouse is trying to develop her ground game or her her stand-up game if they call it i guess stand-up game yeah probably ground game is the wrong way of saying it stand-up game basically her boxing skills hand-to-hand combat uh, Ron, um holly Holm, of course is going to be improving her skills as well she's now world champion and she is not going to let that down without a good fight so i can see this fight being even more of a beating for Ronda Rousey. I mean, how's Ronda going to come back? We don't know what Ronda's going to come back like. Um, how does she come back from getting completely smashed a bit? How does she come back from knowing that the person she's getting in the ring with kicked her ass the first time around and he's liable to kick her ass again? Does Ronda even want this rematch? Did she want the rematch now? Did she ask for the rematch? And all the terrible about abuse that she's probably got over social media and the fact that she's no longer champion. There's a lot of things that Ronda Rousey has to overcome. If Ronda Rousey was to come back and beat Holly Holm, I'd have to say it was a fix now, you know, by July. Because I don't believe the way she got beat so badly and got a counter punch. Either Holly Holm left her, her, her stand-up game at home or she's been told to, 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 you know, to lose the fight. Because, I'm sorry, you, you, you can't um, just forget how to box and Holly Holm's a good boxer. So she doesn't beat her there. And and even when Ronda tried to take Holly Holm down, that didn't work either. So all these people pushing for this immediate rematch need to have their head examined. Absolutely ridiculous. And, um, you know, this is the end of Ronda Rousey. And I doubt if she'll become champion again. Um, not if they're going to have this immediate rematch. Let me know your thoughts. Am 